and introducing to you first. Fighting out of the blue corner, he weighed in at 76.8 kilograms and trains under Chris Drummond and Khan Sandy at a Hobart Training Centre. Fighting out of Hobart, Tasmania, with an amateur record of six wins, one loss, and two draws. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Tom Ackley! And introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. He weighed in at 76.8 kilograms and trains under Ben Vickers at a scrappy MMA. Fighting out of Perth, Western Australia, with a perfect amateur record of four wins for zero defeats. Ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together, make some noise for Lawrence Manton Whitesmith! Of Tom Ackley and Lawrence Whitesmith. Ten. And here we go, scheduled for three three minute rounds. And Lawrence straight into the center of the cage. And you get that, that kick up there, straight, relentless, like we saw in the last fight. Oh, look at this. And it's he's nice. done well to sit out and roll there. It's, an it's a great, position, little, great little scramble here. It was, uh, the takedown was stuffed nicely by Ackley, but uh, found him in a very awkward position right now, both fighters. But Lawrence is doing well to control and try and isolate one of those arms, and he can use that, switch his hips and turn back in. And you can see reaching for the legs. He just wants to end on top. And that's the most important thing. Like he has straight into side control. And this is where he's got the body lock. Good work by uh, White Smith, the man child. And this is where he wants to start working, start making him turn away and try and expose that back and, and create a, a back attack exposure from here. But he's happy to sit here, use that cage to his advantage, use the cross face and just dominate in terms of uh, position and, and control. Yep, some good uh, early moments for Whitesmith, but uh, Tom Ackley very strong as he makes his way back up to the feet, That's using Lawrence. the cage nicely. Mm. Lawrence with the knee on belly and sort of a rick standard, but has maintained the body lock position here. And this is where we can see, you can look, there's engaging those legs and the trips like we didn't see in the heavyweights earlier. He's trying to trying to create opportunities here. Switches to a single, oh, that's beautiful sit out there. Is the cage there? I think you heard some reactions yeah. from the uh, crowd, the crowd as well. Yeah. I thought he was. He got away with that one there, Tom Ackley. But Lawrence is relentless. Tom's doing really well to negate these attacks, but uh, Lawrence just doesn't stop. Yeah. And, uh, you're speaking to the scrappy MMA boys. Yeah, they, they, yeah. they say that he works extremely hard in the gym. His cardio is is second to none and he's just threatening with those trips non-stop while he's got the upper body control threatening with those trips and then trying to transition to a single here and that's just keeping it keeping it mixed up tom's doing well to try and sit out again here but again this pressure is just exhausting and we've seen white smith before he's got the the ability to keep this pace up over all rounds Still in our opening round, and uh, Whitesmith working extremely hard yeah, to, uh, to get to secure this double. And Tom's amazing takedown of Whitesmith. Yeah. Straight Good job back by up. Whitesmith. But he's still, still in a very dominant position. Now this is wearing big time on both athletes here. Defending this non-stop for three minutes is very tough. Yes, exactly. Looks tiring, mm. as you said, just watching it. <laughs> But and I think Lawrence, confidence-wise, is he's dominated this round in terms of um, positioning. Still hasn't been able to completely secure downs. some positions. So again, <laughs> looking both. Then heading into round two, this match up presented by proper number twelve, Irish Whiskey. Nice and there by Ackley to start round two. Opening up nicely. And looping right that one. Yeah, and that lead front kick from uh, Lawrence just flicks up there very quick. Nice exchange spot, both fighters there, both having their moments mm. as Whitesmith goes with the left. Uh, this is where Lawrence needs to, I mean, Tom needs to use his length here and just keep it at his range that he wants. He can't let Lawrence dictate it. And there's a, landed a great shot there. Nice punch there by Ackley. Nice. That, that was nice. There's there's that level change, beautiful level change. And this is where it's a dangerous position for Ackley to get caught with that arm exposed up there. This is where Lawrence can use that to his advantage. You can see Tom lets go of it. So hard to take down, yeah. isn't it? But now he's exposing his back. But Lawrence can't get overexcited here. That's where he can look, start look, looking for trips. ackley has got a real solid base. He's strong. Yeah, he's very strong. 
And we said in the uh, walkouts that uh, Ackley doesn't want to get his back taken by uh, Whitesmith. Mm. So he was. Uh, also, he, he, doesn't want, he, doesn't want, he doesn't want to sit here after the first round either. And you can see that he, he's much more forward this round. He wants. To, he doesn't want to get stuck on the cage again. So he's leading with that one too, trying to control the cage. That's the thing is he always engages right. his own takedown. It's a good move by and uh, this, is a, this is a big uh, confidence turn. If he can secure this after Lawrence has fought for so long to, to secure something and not, not be able to get it, this is a big change for the fight if he can secure this. <laughs> so I've got a good position here, mm. And this is Lawrence is going to look to reach and sit out here. But gets it. Very nice. And let's see if does Lawrence spring back up. Because that's why Ackley has been able to do yeah. this time. Because this is the tiring thing again for both fighters here. Oh, look, he's yeah. going to take his back. Great position here for Ackley. Wow. If he can, he's got one hook in there now. Let's see if he can work to to secure that second. But this is a very dominant position for Ackley. Great, great confidence because he's secured both hooks now and he's got full back control here. This is a massive change, massive. I think, in in the the swing of the fight now. If Ackley knows what he's got grappling wise. It depends what uh, Ackley can do here because he's got 30 Great seconds hand control to work. here. Look at that. Yeah, great that's... stuff by Whitesmith. That is a great move. And that's the thing is when you get too complacent with this full back control, you can lose you lose the position completely. And now this swings around again if Lawrence can secure a, a takedown here. This exploded, didn't he? Mm. Explosive. He's got amazing takedown defense, Tom. Such an intriguing battle this yeah. one, Daniel. I mean, it's a very tough one to score. He did secure the takedown, but didn't lose. But yeah, it's interesting. That, that first round was clear cut. I think the second, how the way it ended, it's closer. still tough to, yeah, tough close to, to call. Yeah, closer to the score. But again, they've got to put that in the mind. That mm. It could be 1-1. One, one. You're heading into yep. the third and final round, so it's all on the line here. Now you need to make a difference. Prelim uh, feature is uh, living up to expectations. A great uh, battle here. Two young guns. Certainly are. Well, I really like that long jab of Lawrence when he actually throws it out. It's great. Tom's really leading with the one-two using that. That's a great turn in the corner. Great stuff there yeah, by Yeah, beautifully stuffed. But this is, again, Tom doesn't want to get caught here and, and engage in here like we saw the whole first round. He's so strong. Mm. Lawrence transitions beautifully from the double to single, up to the clinch, then back down to singles again. Like we said, it's so tiring just watching him transition non-stop. Oh, and there nice. we go. But again, straight back up, beautiful. Straight back down, and now, and now this is a dominant position. If he can secure this hook, and now he's, if he can expose his back here, this is a very, very similar to his last fight. Tom's done very well to defend, and now he's gonna try and turn into him and use the cage uh, as a backstop. But Lawrence has done really well to maintain this position and stop him from turning in and control that left, left shoulder from turning back into him. And he's controlling that far hand, which is allowing Lawrence to try and scoot him behind. Now he transitions to that front headlock straight into a shot. Tom's been using this sit out all fight. Oh, that's uh, yeah, wow, no, look mate. At no, look at that. But then again, Tom's exploding it's straight back in. Does so well to to uh, retain position. He's uh, sprawling very well, mm, and then very well. not been able to uh, hold him down. He's uh, White Smith. Again, this is the hard thing on the scorecards now where Tom needs to have a little bit of urgency. You can't let Lawrence just transition like this. And Even though he hasn't secured the takedown, judges are still going to score this, to me, towards Lawrence. Oh, yeah, they're separated nice. now. So this is going to be very interesting moments in our third and final round of our feature prelim bout. And I think Tom, Tom knows that, and he knows what happened last round. He had the grappling advantage when he got him down. Look, he's done it again. He's done it again. And he's circling, circling again, like we saw in that first one, to expose the back. He's in a very dominant position here from Turtle. And if he can expose his back, oh, and he's, he has, he's done it. He's got one hook in. Can't see from this angle. The one hook in now. Look at that. So Beautiful impressive line. there by Beautiful. Whitesmith. Just a non-stop scrambles. And that's the one thing that Tom, Tom has rushed. Yep. But now he's in, again, oh. this is a dominant position. Yep, top position as we close, come to a closing stage of our third and final round. And I think Lawrence needs to be real active off, off his back here, get the hips moving and stand. He's going to try and sit out here. I don't think he needed to do that. But, uh, yeah, and he's Tom. He's got back in a good position though. And here's that front headlock transition. Yeah. 
So you can use that to set up an anaconda or use it to pass the arm and, and then transition to the back. But well done, Lawrence, standing up. This is the fight. This is the oh, beautiful head kick. Finishes. Oh, yeah. look at that. Nice left there by Whitesmith. Big well, shot. Left kick. That was a great. Well, ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. Judge one scores the fight, 29-28 to the red corner. Mm -hmm. Judge two scores the fight, 29-28 to the blue corner. And judge three scores the fight, 29-28 for your winner by a split decision in the blue corner.